Hey everybody, welcome to JLB Sports TV. I'm Justin Block, and in light of this Sunday's World Cup Final, Spain versus Holland, I'm bringing you another wonderful simulated FIFA 10 World Cup Edition game. Adam and I will be playing the Spain-Holland Final. I, of course, will be playing Holland, because I'm a quarter Dutch, and Adam, being the jerk, will be playing Spain. Alright, here it goes. Spain versus Holland, World Cup Finals. Here it is. Stupid Spanish fans. So for this game, I think it's going to be really dependent on who's going to win the midfield battle. Obviously, Zabi and Alonso, uh, Zabi and Yesta, who's going to throw an excellent in midfield, and literally they just going to pass after pass after pass. They just pass you to death, similar to what Barcelona does. So, that's De Jong, Mark, Mark, Mark Van Bommel, the two, the two uh, sheriffs in midfield for the Dutch are really going to have to work hard and secure the possession and shut, or try to shut this game midfield down. The Dutch are going to have a chance to win this game. Um, here's the Spanish lineup with Zabi on the left and Torres, we starting Torres, because I think Torres will start in this game. And there is the familiar Dutch lineup. Nothing different there. The Dutch lineup. Um, so one thing that really worries me for the Dutch is the pace of the Spanish forwards. Uh, the Dutch really haven't played against a pacey forward like uh, that of Fernando Torres, even that of David Villa. They just haven't played against one yet. Uh, obviously, they, they played against Romino, and they obviously had trouble with his pace, with the ball. So it'll be interesting to see how the Dutch defense, the old Dutch defense, very old, there's some old dudes in there, deal with Fernando uh, Torres' pace. If he has any, because I think it's pretty clear that he is not at match fitness coming off that knee surgery. Time to score. Schneider with the beautiful through ball to open up the play. And Percy just smashes it home. Is that gonna happen in real life? Uh, I do think Van Percy is certainly overdue to score. He certainly is overdue to score in this game. I mean, in the World Cup. I mean, he's a star forward that has no goals. Also, another interesting story going like to see, I think that you all probably know about, is that David Villa. Spain and Russia Schneider of the uh, Netherlands, they're both tied for five goals. So whoever scores is probably going to win the Golden Boot, and if they win the Golden Boot, then my money's on them to also win the World Cup. Off the Robin run, slots it home. Whoa! Uh -huh. Played some of those classic Spanish passing charm games, the little one twos to get back in the game. Because right now the Dutch are controlling possession, and my bet is whoever controls possession in the real game is going to win the game and eat your casillas. Beautiful save. So right now, like I said, we left need to do Mark Van Bommel and then De Jong are completely shutting down the Spanish midfield. The Dutch are controlling possession and the Dutch are getting the uh, more chances. One thing that also the Dutch will have to do if they want to win on Sunday, and I guess I am treating them as the underdogs because they are is to physically abuse the Spanish forwards, mainly Fernando Torres. As a Liverpool fan, I've seen many times where Torres can become absent in games just because he gets a little physical attention from the, uh, from the center backs. Half time, 2-0. Super match facts. Ooh, some good highlights. Please. Oh my goodness. Shot off Adam. Oh! And that's the kind of 
kind of shot that Robin's been making all tournament. Cutting, cutting in on his, uh, on his uh, left foot. Nice little play shot. He's got a whole new name for that shot. Oh, off the post again. Oh my that. god. Maybe I shouldn't be talking. Yeah. It's twice off the post. <laughs> The past minute. Oh, yeah. What is going on? Again off the post! What is going on? Are you serious? That act, that's like the fourth time off the post. Are you joking? Wow, Jesse. Jesus Christ. Thank you. Playing the violin. <laughs> so looks like Daddy Bia is going to win the Golden Boot. Very confident on the ball. Uh, this isn't about to happen. This isn't about to be your ride. Holland, oh my goodness! Oh, oh Fernando Torres can't catch a break. Oh, okay. How many extra, extra time do I get? Not much. The Dutch win! The Dutch win! I want to see the trophy celebration. The Dutch win! Ah! I know Brian Babble isn't going to get a cap, but... Ah! 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 <laughs> I need turkey to eat. I need to win game. 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 I don't care. That's a weird looking trophy. If you guys know what the World Cup trophy well, is, oh yeah, that's a globe, that's a globe. Yeah, if you know what the World Cup trophy is, is, tell me, because I don't know what the hell it's supposed to be. That's a globe with a cup on it. Oh, so See, it's, that's, that's so, a cup and that's a globe. So it's literally a World Cup. Yeah, it. Brilliant feat though, just brilliant. So, um, you have to think Spain are the favorites in this game. Um, they're Spain. If you had to create a lineup from any players in the world, you would probably pick a lineup close to what Spain has. Um, Talent-wise, roster-wise, they have the best. They have the best team in the entire tournament, uh, without a doubt. But I think the Dutch can go seven out of seven. It's gonna be a very close game, very interesting game. Um, in terms of after actual predictions, I'm pretending to be biased. I do think the Netherlands will pull it off. This is a team that. As the talent to do so, they have the talent to knock off Spain. They just have to try. I think in the beginning they have to try and get on top and control possession. They can't. They can't get Germany, which means they can't let. They can't let Spain control the possession and just sort of mesmerize them with passing back and forth and back and forth. They, you can't get past the death against Spain because you're going to lose. So it's very important that the Dutch come out. Assert themselves, be a strong side, control possession, like I know they can, and like they have been all tournament, and make Spain work for it. And don't be afraid to knock around Spain. Knock around Fernando Torres a bit. Knock around these Spanish players. Whoever wins the midfield battle, I think, is uh, very likely to win the game. So my final prediction will be a 2-1 Netherlands victory. Of course, can't always take my word for it. I'm a little bit biased. Um, but really, I wouldn't be surprised if Either team came up on came out on top and neither should you. So that's all for today of JLB Sports TV. I'm Justin Block. Hope you enjoy this joyous Sunday. World Cup final. Hop Holland. If you're Spanish, um, good luck to you. And uh, I can't wait. <laughs>